Yo, what's going on guys? Uh, back with our King Gaming video and uh, today I'm playing a Tiny with a twist. I don't know what the fuck this map this is, but uh, we'll see. Okay, great pit has opened. Alright, sounds uh, nice I guess. What the fuck is this? Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god, it, so it's like a Tiny map with like a, a big fucking hole in the middle of the map I'm Gaia so I could like put Gaia Force right here wall one side off and defend the other one if that works oh it works yeah nice so I'm gonna wait until my villager is finished and then H up so I have two instead of one so I can build shit faster the fuck can it can they go down the fuck Oh my god, this map. Alright, so let's see. Just gonna make some houses here. <laughs> this map, man, what the fuck am I playing? Holy shit. <laughs> Damn. Okay, so he lost his scout. That's uh, good for me, but it doesn't really matter anyway. But yeah, uh, not much happening right now. So let's see what he's gonna do. I'm sure he, he has never played this map either. I'm also pretty sure this map is like randomly generated, like with random shit. Like next time it's gonna be like a, a fucking hole in, in the corner or something. Something crazy. So I like to hear all my villagers in Tiny to build faster. I'm gonna auto queue the oracles. And I'm gonna build my armory in the corner. If I get fission. There we go. Yeah. Just gonna place this bad boy here. Gonna hero this one. This one too. <laughs> Just gonna out queue it to the middle. I'm gonna go. Yeah, bird sounds like a good idea because like a big hole I can fly over. So you always want to build towers on tiny. Let's see. This it is like this feels like fucking mad at like multitasking on both sides of the map. Even though I'm gonna guy force one side. So uh it's not gonna really be a uh, like meta I guess after all but I'll j build some uh, build some shit here just in case alright there we go tower upgrade yeah so this temple is gonna go down soon if he doesn't destroy it build some chair blisters oh shit he's gonna unroll me so I'll just build the more lush so he cannot like place it on the road. Let's see if I can repair this house. Yeah, it's too late though. Just gonna garrison this here. If I can. Place this here. The fuck? So I cannot garrison out of it. I'm stupid. I can just go into the house. There we go. So let's make a palace when I get en enough favor. Cyclops against a villager. The epic fight. So I'm going to build a, a palace right here. There we go. Yeah. There's a good shit right there. So he's going to go uh, mythic as well. I hope my tree is going to be up soon so I can block his earthquake. So I'll just uh, use this here. 
So is he gonna just walk through here to Earthquake V? I mean, he has no flying units or... Oh wait, he can make a Pegasus though. So... Oh, he's just walking through it. Okay. <laughs> right. Alright, let's make some destroyers to uh, destroy shit, you know. Let's block this, smash it up. Let's upgrade everything. Oh my god, I'm not even going mythic, holy fuck, I'm bad. Report me. Report me for feeding. If you play leak, you'll get it. Which probably most of you do, so. I have a shitload of villagers though, so that's good for me. I can just keep building. So I'll just tell these villagers to build shit. Oh, and there's the earthquake. Isn't gonna do that much though. Or actually maybe a little bit, you know, but... Should we hero this one? So let's carry some point uh, or rally point uh, all of this to here. I'm just fucking confused by the map, honestly. <laughs> what the fuck am I playing? Holy shit. It's a crazy map. It is indeed tiny with a twist, like a big twist in the middle, basically. I'm gonna place this big boy plant in the middle here. He's gonna have bell, bell test for dinner. Yeah. It's a little trap gem here. Let's <laughs> move along. Guys, come on. Oh my fucking god. Let's go. There we go. Oh, I still just Calidria. I can just fly across the the void and cast this bad boy over here. And the guy of force for the BM. That's how we do it. Oh shit, I'm housed. This is like how to be noob 101. Prepare this. All right, here we go. Let's upgrade this. I don't even have army upgrades. Holy shit! They seem to be doing work though, so that's good for me. I'll just keep building towers. That's what guy does anyway. Yeah. So let's check his army upgrades to see how he's doing. So he only has one, two. I have one, zero. <laughs> oh wait, I should have one now. Yeah, I have to fire arrows. So yeah, this Tatarian gate really finished him off, I feel like. So right here, I just gotta keep pushing. Honestly, I should just auto queue these bad boys. The new unit for EE, the O nature. It's gonna own a little bit, you know, for what I mean. Yeah. these big boys are getting stuck here so I'm just going to turn this off yeah he, he's down for it. he has nothing left <laughs> GG weird map so 
So let's see if I can do some more tiny matches. This one was a little bit short. So I'm going to host another match. One v one tiny, all welcome. So let's play a regular tiny this time. Should we do? Let's do it again. I want to see what kind of variations this map has. So we we've seen a big hole so far. A big asshole. And uh, let's see what's going to be next. So I hope someone joins soon. Maybe the same guy. I hope. There we go, someone is joining. Let's go. Second tiny game with a big twist. Let's see what kind of twister we get this game. Launching the game. Yeah. Raw against Poseidon. Okay. So I have shift and sense in case it's the same type of map again. We need to get past the trees. Okay. I think I have a rock though for that if there's like trees and shit. Hey, let's count them up a little bit. Fucking not it though with these crazy ass maps. Alright, I'm just gonna build oracles around here. Alright, I'm gonna go shift and sense. Because I figured that I need like some kind of teleportation to get across the sea of trees gonna cast the rain should have probably used it or not used it to block the earthquake later into the game but you know whatever we are going all in we're not gonna play for the late game Oh, it's actually very, very short. So if you're a Tor, actually, you can uh, fire forest it. Poseidon actually has no means of fucking getting across this tree. See, like, this is actually fucking unbalanced as shit. Holy shit. <laughs> this game mode is such a troll. I bet he knows it's coming too, like the fucking shift in sense. I'm just gonna go for uh, scarabs. Gonna build two monuments. And then shift all my scarabs over to his TC. I'm not gonna have the eclipse though for the scarab boost. But uh, it's gonna be fine either way, probably. So I'm just gonna keep making these priests. I bet this watcher just feels like an endangered species right now, species with all the priests around him. Let's have like bonus damage against it. Twelve priests won't watch it. So I guess I'll build some towers meanwhile. Not gonna really do much though. So should I just guess that I can finish him off with the shifts in sense and scarabs or should I go to rocks? Like I'm I'm like thinking still. Because with the rock I can just like keep going over and over. But the scarabs are way more effective by uh, like taking down town centers. Okay, that's enough priest. We're not trying to make uh Fucking in the Pope Palace or something. Alright, so I'm just gonna keep building these houses. So I'm gonna upgrade my signal fires so I can actually see across. Right now I can barely uh, shift the incense across it, but I wanna have some more vision to do it, so I'm gonna get that. And yes, you can get the signal fire upgrade from a fucking obelisk crazy right all kinds of crazy so he went through Aphrodite 
Uh, picks are not going to be really effective. It's only going to be effective against my villagers. Which I guess if I bring them along. Uh, it's going to be trouble for me actually. Because I cannot build this base. I have to finish him off in one go. So it's actually going to be pretty tough. Uh, <laughs> we might have to fucking cut the boot down after all. If like I don't win with the shift and sand push. So I'll just go... Uh, tornado just in case so I'm gonna cast this citadel or however you pronounce that shit so I'm gonna get all the tower upgrades gonna this one the, the carrier picnics plus six building line of sight he's <laughs> like scouting across to see what I'm doing I bet he saw those scarabs. I'm actually not sure if he saw those. I hope not, because then he knows it's coming. So I'm sure he can tell by the god powers that I have that I'm gonna do this. It's quite obvious actually. It's whatever though. So I'm gonna go tornado. This game mode though, it's still super messy, so if like no one wins, like it's just like a stalemate because no one can cut the forest down. Oh, uh, wait, we just got fire forest, never mind. But like if there wasn't fire forest, you could actually build a fucking wonder in the corner. Then I'll like wait 10 minutes. It's crazy though. So, let's see if he has fire forest too, yeah he does. Nice, so uh, I'm gonna just wait for my last scarab and my tornado and then I'm gonna go all in. <laughs> he has a lot of towers so that's gonna be kind of difficult actually. I have to uh, I'll have to tornado that down. The weather report is kind of like uh windy soon. So uh if you're in the area of Tiny Twister, then uh, be careful. I actually just gave him more room to build. What a genius play. Mechanical genius. Tactical mastermind. Keen flame. <laughs> oh man, I just gave him more room. What a fucking clown fiesta this game is. Yeah. So I'll just get this just in case that he like does some weird shit with earthquakes. All kind of natural disasters on this map. It's the way how, t how tiny it goes. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just waiting right now. So shoot I fucking tornado his army or his towers I feel like I should tornado his towers because that's the only thing that's stopping me from taking him out he's gonna build a fortress here I should have definitely saved uh, my uh, rain alright let's see come on It actually didn't destroy shit. Holy shit. That's some shit right there. Yeah, he fucking... <laughs> he piggy picked my uh... My villagers. I'm probably actually gonna lose this game, honestly. I have zero villagers left. I should have definitely saved the rain. There's too many towers too. Yeah, I'm gonna lose. Worst strategy NA EU combined. Damn. He has no TC though, so maybe I can turtle it out, but I really doubt it. Especially once he has the fortress which he has up right now. Yeah, it's just too many towers. There's not really much I can do about it right now.
Oh man, this map. GG. <laughs> Let's go more. Alright, so uh, this is going to be the rematch. So uh, let's play a normal tiny now. I'm done with these weird twist maps. This guy just twists my ass on the twister map. Alright, let's play some real tiny. Some real small Isis against Orenas. All right, so I'm not actually the Orenas. This is actually a very shitty tiny map. Holy shit! It's not the like the usual one, I think. All right, so I'm gonna shockwave this to delay him. All right, let's win this. Let's win this game. Uh, I should have heroed my other oracle. The TC was already focusing the wrong one. It's whatever though. So what you want to do is create a, a like a wall in the middle, and then you want to alt S your villagers so they don't get like interrupted. There we go. Then you just out of queue uh, oracles. Here are your citizens. Regarrison your villagers if they get too damaged. Have a little villager fight with your oracle and the villager. So I'm just gonna RDQ the oracles into my manor and then I'm just gonna send them over to his uh, spot. Alright, here we go. So I'm gonna go heroic soon. Gotta get my towers up. So I'm gonna go for chaos, I guess. This is such a like a like a real real tiny map. Like the usual ones are a little bit like more rectangle than this. Oh my god, I lost a villager. I didn't pay attention to that. But once I have my tower up, it's gonna be a uh, good sailing from there. Hoping to get his tower up before my villager dies. There we go. So I wanna bring this one back a little bit. Gonna finish this tower first. He's gonna micro it. There, there you saw him doing it. Okay. Eclipse. Interesting. So I probably wanna make my market first. Gonna upgrade all my eco upgrades. Just gonna keep fluting with oracles that do like absolutely nothing. They're just like annoying. There's like building blocking him. Alright, I'm gonna go uh Tatarian Gate. Or maybe not. Or maybe yeah, I'll go uh I'll go uh Helios. So 
I'm just gonna keep focusing these villagers that are like trying to build a tower. Yeah, I cannot cast any god powers because of the monument. So I'll choose just to play it out the normal way. <laughs> so I'm gonna get rid of my villages right here. So I wanna take out his crocodile. He's trying to take out my setter toward the same moment. Oh shit, it's priest range though. Alright, I can uh, put my villagers back out again. So right now what I need is to stop Hero and my fucking oracles and make a palace. That sounds like a good idea to me. Probably want to destroy this so my uh, Heka Giant can uh, do some stuff. He's pretty tanky even against Priest. My Promenade is gonna help out too. Yeah, those slingers like throwing stones at towers is not gonna do much, probably. It's probably not the best idea. But I feel like there's not much he can do at this point. Like, tiny early game is like you gotta make a wall of houses and just like really tower up and get to mythic ASAP. So at this point I'm just gonna get some more eco upgrades even though it does nothing, like absolutely nothing. And here I'm gonna build a palace. So I'm thinking about just destroying this eco guild and then making my fire siphons go through here, through the left side. So this is like the output, this is the input, you know. <laughs> they can kind of like walk circles if they want to. Role play. Yeah, this this feels like more like a tower defense right now, but the waves are like not that strong at all. Actually, I can make this new range unit. So I'm just gonna keep expanding. It's gonna build in this uh, base. I just gotta watch my hero villager. Yeah, that's game over. GG. So let's get one more game in. One more game. One for one tiny. So I actually forgot which one I just chose, but I'm assuming it was this one because it felt pretty old. So I'll just go with this one this time. And then hopefully this one is going to be a really good game. So I'm just waiting for an uh, opponent right now. Who is gonna be the challenger?
There we go, there's someone. Girls, or however you pronounce that, is gonna take up the challenge. Alright, here we go, Zeus. Yeah, this is a better tiny map. It's like more like a rectangle, so you get you get like more build space. One, two, three, four, five. Oh man, that's going to delay him a lot. Alright, so I'm going to build my temple. My house is in a wall. Going to go... Uh, let's see... Ceasefire, I guess. So I can stop his towers from building if I need it. Or like a MIG door or something. So I'm Zeus, I don't really need to pray right now. Because I already have enough favor for a fortress. So I'm going to get my max amount of houses off right away in the middle. So I might as well just pray for uh, 30 seconds with my villagers, there's nothing else to do. Maybe make a, a Pegasus for fun. To scout around to see what he's doing. So he's making a monument, he's making some obelisk, some more houses, alright here we go. So I might just rush for uh, an world and lightning storm to take him out fast with hoplites or something. Ah oh, damn. Serpents might actually hurt. Villagers aren't that bad against serpents though. Like I'll show you. They kill them pretty fast. Like look at this. So I'm going to gather some of my hoplites inside my uh, building. Alright, so I dealt with the uh, serpents. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna have like space for in the world, but we'll see. I'll just garrison some uh, Pegasus inside my uh, temple so we cannot like shoot him down yet. Gonna finish these towers up. Gotta alt S those so they don't get interrupted. Let's see. Oh wow, it actually fits. So there we go. So I'm going to make a, a market right here. <laughs> it's kind of like a suicide mission, so I'm not going to lie. But once I get my towers up, uh, it'll be fine. So I can always... Uh, oh my god, it's actually fading really hard. Oh shit, I should, have, I should have waited probably. I mean it's delaying him a little bit though, so it's fine I guess. I'll just make a fortress instead. Sounds like a more solid plan. Yeah, he's actually focusing my... Uh, my uh, village really well with, it, with his priest across the across the map. Yeah, he, he has the range upgrade too. And the smart thing he did, he saw me building the fortress, so he casts his ancestors to bait out my ceasefire, so it delays my uh, my uh, fortress. That was really clever. Like I, I'm, I'm not sure if it was like intentional, but it was pretty clever either way.
Oh, I forgot the pack is <laughs> So I'm gonna just... Oh shit, I cannot pass through it. So we can actually uh, make the market right there. So there we go. Lightning Storm will really deal with those priests though. He has a few spots to get his own priest inside though if he can react fast enough. Let's see if he garrisons them. Yeah, he, he gets on a few of them. So I'm gonna go for Caterpillars. I'm gonna build all my heroes. And I'm gonna delete my temple to march into his base and finish him off once and for all. Ah, oh, shit, he's, he's got the juiciest meteor though. Boom. I probably should have grabbed my uh, building upgrade. So I'm gonna repair my town center. I'm gonna destroy his uh, siege workshop. And I'm gonna try to take his migdal out after that. I'm gonna rebuild my stuff. I'm gonna try to focus down his villagers that are building the Migdo with my Odysseus. So I see him repairing. Yeah, he was repairing it with one villager, but it wasn't enough. So I'm just going to take out the siege tower. I really need Odysseus again, but I have no favor to make him. So this bird is not going to be trouble because it's too low. <laughs> it died. So I'm just going to build this fucking rhino. Gonna hunt the mythic right here. I'm gonna make these bad boys. There we go. I probably really should garrison my uh, old villager fight. He's going all in. Yeah, I was gonna go for the TC. GG. Well played, man. That was a good game. That's probably the best one of the four the games that I played today in Tiny. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, Tiny Little series, you know. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.